Yellow spinners! Alex Suhov is here and in this video I wanted to show you how to do a good heavy pen mod, which is called Ivan mod or Buster CYL2. Yeah, some people call it this way as well. Ivan mod is one of the top 5 recommended pen mods for beginners in pen spinning. I have made a video about this top 5 pen mods and you can check it out if you still haven't, link in description below this video on YouTube. And in the future I think I would make a full review of this mod. Search it on the channel, maybe I have made it already by the time you watch this video. You can also use this video to modify the mod which you already have or just for your interest to know how they are made because yeah you can buy it directly from me on penstock.net the specialized shop for pen spinners only to avoid to go through all the tortures which i'm going to go through today no i just kidding this mod ivan is very easy to make you will see that so to make ivan mod you will need a simple pencil or a useless body or both, a sharp office knife or a blade or a scalpel, something really sharp, a ruler and clue. You will need clue as well. Two Crayola bodies. I will use these two bodies to make certain color scheme. One air fit grip, two air fit tips, two air fit rings, one enable grip or more. You will need four sections of this grip. I will show you with this dark blue, as it is left after I tried to make my first Ivan yesterday. Yes, guys, I'm not a pen modder. My hands grow directly out of S. If you feel the same, please be very careful with the knife. If you are not, well, probably you will make something more beautiful than my first experience. Ok, so that's all we need to do Ivan mod. If you don't have any of this, go to penstock.net to spare part section and pick the all stuff you need from there. First of all, take one of the Crayola Super Tips bodies and cut 4 cm pieces from both sides of it. Take a look at the side where colored lid should be. This side you need to measure 4 cm from the edge, where the body actually starts. Take your knife and push the body with it, then wheel it several times. There are two ways of cutting the body. You can cut it a little bit and then break them in pieces. Or the second way you push the knife strong enough, so the knife will cut the body. I prefer the second way, as the first may make edge look slovenly. Alright, so we cut the crap out of this body from both sides. Middle part goes to garbage bin. We wouldn't need it anymore. Remember to be very careful with the knife. And if you injured yourself, please don't let me know about that in the comment section below. I don't wanna imagine your pain and the all these blood streams from your fingers. Now we need to prepare two pieces of animal grips. To do that, take the pencil or the useless body, it may be a pen, something to put the grip on. After we put it on, we count two sections and push the grip into the indent by the knife. After that, roll the body, guiding the knife along the indent several times. Make it slow and careful to make the cutting smooth. Make sure that you cut the animal grips very carefully in the indent. Put it away and cut another two sections piece the very same way. Now we take a fit grip and put it on a pencil, something thin enough to be able to put it on without any troubles. Then get it close to a ruler and put the knife at the middle. A fit grip is 4.5 cm long, so the middle would be at the point of 2.2-2.3 uh, cm. Push the grip at this place pretty hard and wheel the body around, guiding the knife along the grip. Try to hold the knife strong and straight, otherwise the edge would look bad and uneven, like this. Here I made a mistake putting this edge at the external side of my mud. Yeah, you will be able to hide it. 
Okay, and now we need to put the animal grip pieces to the Crayola body pieces. I would recommend to do it like this. First, pull it over from one side to another, then pull to the side. I would not recommend to do from the side which you cut. Do it from the clean side, otherwise you may damage the grip. Now connect the Crayola parts, like this. From both sides put on air feed rings. Ok, so now we take one of the air feed tips and put it on a side of the pencil, like this. Then we Put and push the pencil through the grip, starting with the side which was cut to hide the uneven edges. Now just put the grips on the body and adjust them to be nice and flat. It is pretty hard and to make it a little bit easier you can use the soap. Just make sure that you wash it out from the grip after you put the tip into the grip. Alright, now disconnect the parts of Crayola Super Tips and put some glue inside the bodies. Otherwise, they wouldn't stick to each other. Be careful to not to split the glue over the body. Congratulations! Your Ivan is ready. You can choose any color scheme you want. To do that, to get colorful bodies, you will need to pick up the copies of Crayola Super Tips bodies on penstock.net. Of course, original parts are also available, but Crayola Super Tips originals are available only in white or black colors. They are also a little bit more expensive, but these are good quality original parts. If you liked this video, let me know about that by leaving the comment in the comment section below this video on YouTube or leaving the like or both also would help. Share this and other videos with your friends to let them know about our little underground world. Check out their other playlists with the mod reviews and trick tutorials and other useful and interesting playlists on this channel. Subscribe to this channel if you still haven't been spinning grows and blossoms here. May the style be with you guys. Bye. Subscribe to the channel if you still haven't been spinning blows and grossums here. Yeah. Blows and grossums.